<laughs> okay, that was that. I like how I start all my videos. Yeah. So impromptu. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I am joined here with one of my good new friends. I found him off the street. Yeah. <laughs> follow. He has a YouTube channel, by the way. Yeah, don't follow me. It's it's boring. But he does have a a website. And oh yeah, my studying, photography like, website. Your, yeah. He does I find portraits. <laughs> this girl's in bikinis for you guys out there. Well, so today it is typical Monday. Not really Monday when we're shooting this, but it's Monday to you. It's Friday. It's Friday, no. Friday. Get down. I promised you that we were gonna do a summer blockbuster movie review. So, what I did with all of my spare time, which is all summer, I watched all of the movies. Most of the movies for you in combination of between both of us. We only saw four together. So. First movie, this is the end. Don't watch this movie with your mother because it will suck for you. But it's actually really funny because all of the funny people are there. But it just sucks when you're with your mother. It's not one sentence. Oh shit. <laughs> My review is Pineapple Express 2 sucked. Spoiler alert if you haven't seen the movie. And Emma Watson is a royal badass in the movie as well. So she was on the middle like Shh. She's a royal badass. 42. Uh, see, how do you jump from this is the end to 42, right? Um, <laughs> it's a really good documentary, except for the I the only part I really had a problem with because it's just a wake up call to what used to happen back then is when Jackie Robinson was playing the game against I don't know who and the other coach was just pretty much being completely I Yeah. But yeah. Good movie. It is a good I agree. Good movie. I love black people movies what? because it's a black okay. It's a historic black movie, which I love. I love those genres. I always watch those movies because they're just badass. Great Gatsby. <laughs> and if you read the book, you're gonna like it. If you didn't read the book, you might think that it's like a stupid paragraph with the house on movie. Uh, but it's a really good movie and then what's this the music is and, ha, ah, still a sentence, and <laughs> DiCaprio should definitely win a it was good. Well, too bad it's not an Oscar <laughs> But I thought cinematography was like so magically awesome, I felt like a fly because it was just, it's so pretty. Yeah, if you haven't read the book and you plan to watch this or you've seen it, you probably thought these people are on crack and they should be in an asylum. <laughs> Iron Man 3. I okay, don't kill me. I watched it yesterday. <laughs> huh? And I this one all oh, if you want to end a trilogy, you should end a trilogy like this. Don't end with a fizzle, but with a bang. Where's that from? <laughs> oh, you're going to look it up? Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I actually do. I'm just not gonna What? Huh? So Iron Man 3, it was really cool. I mean, the ending was just amazing. Because freaking robots. And the best part about Iron Man 3 is the fact that he can jump from one suit to the other. And, that was, and it's also hilarious how he can't get his baby to work for the whole movie. And at the end, you think, oh, he finally fixed it. It's gonna work. But crashes before he can get to them. Uh, uh, Pacific Rim, you didn't watch it. I didn't do my homework. So I'm gonna do more homework. But. Playing Mario Kart. It's so messed up. Uh, uh, okay, fine. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Pacific Rim. Oh, it's such a good movie. If you like, it's like Godzilla. And do you remember watching those giant robot Japanese robot? Power Rangers. No, not Power Rangers. It's the other Japanese one. Japanese robot. Oh, okay, like like the cartoon one. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you remember? I thought they were Transformers. Yeah, it's like a spawn of Godzilla. That one. And that one. And Real Steel. And Real Steel put together in a cinematic giant explosion of fun. The Purge. The Purge. It's a good movie, but the whole idea behind the movie is a little scary if that ever does happen because that's freaking crazy. I have a question for you guys. If, you, if the Purge was real, who is one person? Technical wise, I guess, it's so hard to speak in the magical words of me. It's alright, I mean, it's really dark, 
throughout the whole because they're it's in one house. No, it's no. I'm talking about like lighting <laughs> wise because it's, it takes place in one house the whole movie pretty much. And it's, That's how you save money in a budget. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now you see me. Oh, such a good movie. Um, if you like magic, which I did, and you like giant mind. F this is the movie to see. Can I review the trailer? Yeah. Sure. Hey, the trailer looks like it's gonna be. It would look like a movie that was gonna be exactly like 20. Actually, it it's like a spawn of 21. Oh, okay. Nailed. It's a 20. It's the movie 21, and Chris Angel <laughs> yeah. produced this movie. That's, that's the result of the movie. It's really good. The cool me too. Yeah. I mean, if you like minions and cuteness and all kinds of funness. I watched half of it. <laughs> Um, it's a really funny movie. Uh, there's a spoiler at the end of the movie, I guess. If it really does happen, it's gonna be a movie. Yeah. What? See, that's what you should have watched. Yeah, and then the minions just, they steal the movie. I mean, all the other characters are garbage compared to the minions in this movie. Especially in the end, from the wedding. Gosh. What? The end, yes, the ending is the best part of the movie. And oh, wait. Okay, I'm gonna yeah. cut this out. The girl, the, the secret agent lady? Yeah, they get married. <gasps> Oh, you didn't watch? Oh, don't, don't cut this out. And since we're talking about cartoon movies, I watched Monsters University. Um... Oh, no. I'm not watching it now. <laughs> no, I, it's... If there was, um... If there was a movie that reflected... Reflected? Reflected. I was gonna say reflected and deflected. <laughs> I mean, the the. Deflect. Reflected. Reflected, okay. whatever. If there's a movie that reflects our life in a monster form... Wow. I didn't see that. <laughs> it was okay. It had a good meaning. It had a very good friendship meaning. That's Fast six. six. I saw it three times. That's all you need to know. Boom! She didn't get through it, but... You know, I remember where I stopped because I wrote it down. An Not hour and a minute. Five um, seconds. <laughs> the only thing that I really didn't understand about this movie was the, the runway at the end of that. It's just ridiculously long. Star Trek! <sighs> if you like Chris Pine, and he's like the hottest thing in the world, then enough said, that's just one point why you should watch this movie. If you like J.J. Abrams, that's another point of watching this movie. The cinematography was beyond 9,000. Like a level? Yeah. Over 9,000! Dragon Ball Z! Oh yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> if you like movies, like general action, big movie, Hollywood type movie, then just Enough said. Just watch this movie. A bunch movie. of words combined to make sense. It's a good movie. Alright, you guys too. First, I'll start off why you should watch it, then I'll review it. But, more like, if you can watch it. If you're a superhero movie, <laughs> I think it's a comedy, then you should definitely watch the guest. But there are some really brutal parts into the, in this movie. Big spoiler alert. My favorite actor in that movie dies. The whole review on it okay, is just it. pretty much... It's a, a kick-ass movie. Shut <laughs> up. Red 2. If you like bald old men with dry humor, it's like Red, the first one, except with an Asian. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't watch The Conjuring. You watched The Conjuring. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. I saw The Purge. Oh, The Purge. I didn't watch The Conjuring. No one saw The Conjuring. No one saw The Conjuring. I'm sorry, people. We suck out. <laughs> okay, let's review the trailer. Are you, you're scared of the trailer? You already saw the movie, you know what I happens. know, but it, I closed my eyes half the time. Oh no, I, I did watch The Conjuring! I did. For, for, okay, I'll say this. For a scary movie, the story wasn't that bad. I'll be nice. It wasn't that bad. For a scary movie, for a Hollywood scary movie, the writing was pretty okay, and I would rate it Four out of no, three out of five ghost sheets. Overall summer review is a little disappointing because these movies, some of these movies were really cheesy. Besides, well, 42 of the Greek Gatsby and I mean, they're okay. Kick Ass 2 was obviously really good, but it's a funny movie. I felt like there was more comedy this summer. Well, that's how it's supposed to be, right? You know, Comedies and like, action movies. Yeah. Are always summer movies. Uh, okay. Overall summer rating, I give it a 3.5. Out of five. Out of what scale is this? Out of five. 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 Out
I would give it 3.3.5 for general overall rating of all these movies of cameras. So that's my summer movie review. That's my very general summer movie review. Obviously, go watch somebody else's video if you want a more detailed review of all these movies. But thanks for watching. You're gonna put that in the YouTube? Obsy Wobs Wee!